So what's going on everybody, it's JediK98 here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to open Pack-A-Punch on Zetsubo no Shima. So we're going to need to go ahead and get three machine parts, and one of them is in a random spot every time, and the other two are in set locations. So the first one is going to be the wheel here, and it's going to have three spawns here in the KT4 plant underwater section down here. You're going to see me go to each location here and kind of show where they are in this area, and this is the three spawn locations that they can show up in. And... Um, It'll be in any one of these three locations for the little wheel, and there you go, you got the first part. Now the next one is going to be over here in the power switch room. All you have to do for this one is go ahead and come down here and turn the power on, wipe away the webs, fight off the zombies, and then it is going to spit out of that area right there. And the last one is going to be in the body bag room with a purple pool area, and what you're going to need to do is melee these body bags here, and zombies are going to pop out, and one of them is going to drop the machine part. There's a ton of body bags, and one of them will drop the last piece right there. So anyway guys, that is how you build that and then we go ahead and take this over here to this uh this section of the map and we place them down on each of these three um little devices right here and what this is going to do is drain the water and now we have access to the pack-a-punch machine right there it's very simple to do this it just costs a lot of points to get into these rooms uh but it's it's very rewarding because of course you get pack-a-punch so anyway guys if you enjoyed this video be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more black ops 3 zombies content i hope this helps you guys build pack-a-punch on zetsubo no shima and i hope you guys enjoy this map so thanks for watching guys and i hope to see you in the next one